So we'll see if uh, people have some uh, questions regarding French learning. And I'm here to help you. So let's see if people will join or not. And if they have some questions, I am here and I'm waiting. So don't be afraid to use the chat option to ask me some questions if you want to ask uh, anything regarding uh, French learning. I will be so pleased to, to uh, answer to your questions or eventually to guide you if you need to have some, uh, some help for the videos and uh, the channel if you get some suggestion. Suggestion, sorry. So uh, don't be afraid. Uh, I will be here. Bonsoir, Isaiah. How are you? So where are you from? Bonjour, everyone. Ahmed. So uh, my level is too low to ask questions, but no, it's never too low. Don't worry about that. Um, so I've been I've been starting the Zoom uh, thing. So apparently there were some persons who, who had some uh, some problem to join the Zoom, and it's been working perfectly. I mean, we had a lesson with the people, so I don't know what uh, what was going on. The, the The lesson will continue. So the good news is that the the, the lesson will uh, the lesson will continue the the, the whole week. So you can uh, you can join uh, the the Zoom lessons um, during the whole week. Uh, obviously, it will be free, and uh, but it will be at the same uh, at the same time. Um, so it will be uh, at four uh, Paris time. So that's uh, that's it. Uh, so Zoom Zoom is uh, Zoom is is on for the the, the whole week. Uh, so Hamza is asking, how can I prepare TCF? TCF, it, it's it's quite interesting. I don't really know Hamza. What what is the the the, the purpose of your your TCF? Could, could you tell me a bit more about it? And uh, I guess I could uh, I could help you. In most of the cases for TCF, because it's a special exam, you really need to um to there are some books. I mean, quite quite good books. And uh, you really need to, to to work on that because it's a special, really special uh, exam. So, uh, but uh, I need to know a bit more about this if if I would. Uh, Grace is asking to improve um, her conjugation. Uh, the conjugation thing, I mean, it, it's like it's really really simple. You need to learn by heart. It's it's really sad, but uh, this is the only thing that will uh, that will work. Um, you will send us an email for Zoom, is asking Mary. Um, yeah, well, it's the same. If you look at the channel, I've been, uh, I've been sending the message with the invitation. So um, it, is, it is on the channel, uh, so you can, uh, you can find it there. And then uh, I guess I will put it, if it's not there, on Facebook and on Frenchforme.net, so you can, uh, you can find it. Uh, I want to ask you about the course. Is it two lessons per week? It will uh, for the TEF for immigration. Um, I don't know, Maya. I mean, you need to give me a bit more uh, information. Two lessons per week. If you're talking about what you're talking about, the the, the Zoom uh, course in the Zoom is free for uh, all this week because I want to I want to offer that uh, because we've got some difficult times now. So I thought it might be better uh, that way. Uh, do you know any sites with movies, series in French? Because in Netflix, there are only a few movies in French I can watch. I am from Poland. Uh, this is the thing, uh, Everina. It's, it's always tricky because uh, Netflix, it's, uh, it's working according to the countries where, where you are. My advice could be to, to go to the, the French channel, but then after that, you will have to use uh, what we call a VPN. So maybe you could uh, start to Google on VPN. Basically, the concept of the B VPN is to, to, well, to pretend somehow that you are in France so you can access the French channels. And the French channels, they will offer you some, uh, some movies and series. Uh, so it could, be, it could be an option for you, uh, Evelina. Uh, thank you. I'm going fine. Uh, Ahmed wanted to know s'il y a des cours on. Yeah. So Ahmed, uh, for the the, the the lessons regarding the the 
uh, you're talking in that case about the pronounce on ECOD. Yeah, you can go. I've been making some videos on YouTube, so uh, just check with these keywords, you will find them. Uh, what level we need to apply for citizenship. Uh, so now the level for citizenship, uh, it's quite interesting because it's a B1, but it's a B1 oral. So basically they don't ask you to uh, to write. So it's a special one. It's a B, B1 uh, oral. And um, so it's B1, it's not B2, which is a good news. So uh, they fit answer to your, your question. Uh, can you recommend us French short stories to read? The thing uh, I've been putting on uh, frenchforme.net, so the platform I've been creating, I've been putting a lot, a lot of uh, French novels and uh, French short stories. And they're free because I consider that it would be... a uh, it would be really strange to start to 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 ask people to pay for a literature. So they are classics. They're 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 free, and uh, in some cases also I'm still working on the making the two two versions. So it would be in French and uh, and English, but it's it's a lot of work. But I'm still working on that. So uh, don't don't worry about that. Uh, have learned more from you than I did at school. No. <laughs> no, no, I'm pretty sure that you've been learning a lot of, uh, at school. So uh, I'm, I'm just here to support. I'm, I'm here to, to help. If you've got uh, some, some questions in that case, you come to YouTube. I mean, this is your generation. And, and that's the point. I mean, this is the good thing. But, but trust, trust in school. Uh, school is important. So what challenges do you experience with teaching a language remotely as opposed to being in person? And how do you think one can close some of those gaps? So it's, it's a good question, Quincy. Um, I, well, well, I like when I'm in, 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 in a class, it's the interaction with the person. So I think it, it's great. But then at the same time, when you, when you start to teach uh, online with people, so not not like that on YouTube, but when you're going through platforms and uh, and and uh, really you can have the interaction. Uh, my God, you go so fast! You go so fast because basically you're writing something. I can try, correct that right away. Talk at the same time, so um, we 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 can uh, we can really work uh, extremely efficiently. Unfortunately, we don't have the the, the interaction that we can have normally in a classroom. But uh, the results are really great, I mean, to my point of view. Are there any textbooks to solve grammar, like negation, COD, COE? Um, yeah, I mean, if you go if you go to try to, I mean, well, technically right now, I mean, all the grammar books are, are, are quite good. Uh, it depends uh, how you want to learn. This is, the, this is the thing. In some cases, people like to go to, uh, uh, through their language, which is, uh, which is quite good. Uh, um, and in other cases, people want to 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 just learn uh, French in French, so it's up to you. But the grammar books, I mean, it's difficult. I mean, grammar books are quite 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 good. I mean, generally, I would go for French personally because I'm French, obviously. Thank you very much for your answer, Evelina. Well, it's my my pleasure. Uh, but yeah, the VPN might be an option for you if you really want to work on the on the language. There is this this app also for. Uh, it's Arte. Uh, Arte is quite good, I think. They 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 offer you the the, the I mean the app, and uh, you can you can watch at, uh, at things. Uh, um, it's on Android, Android. So in, in most of the cases, you 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 can have it uh, if you've got a Android phone or uh, maybe Android TV. Uh, my pleasure, uh, Ahmed. So uh, bonjour. Uh, uh, I cannot help you pronounce that. Uh, Abbas Lyman, sorry, I'm not that good in languages, so thanks for the response, my, my pleasure. From Russia with Love, it reminds me of this uh, interesting James Bond uh, movie, no? Uh, Mary, Total Access, I don't know what you want to say in Total Access, but... So do you think watching French cartoon movie is a good uh, idea to learn French? Yeah, it, it is. It is quite good. It depends what you want to to, to work on, and and uh, there is this this idea that most of the cases people think that watching uh, or reading uh, stories for children is is simple, 
uh, I disagree with that because in most of the cases, all the fairy tales they are using this passé simple, this simple past tense that is extremely challenging. But it, it's always good. Depends what you want to watch, and uh, it, it can be a it can be a first step. Yes. Uh, okay. Happy to 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 help you, uh, Feniro. So uh, and uh, be careful and stay inside and be careful with the virus. All of you, Amanda. Hello from London. Well, I hope everything is okay for you. Uh, so sorry to bother you. I was wondering if the free da, 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 cancelled. No, no, it, it was not. I don't know what's happened with the Zoom. It was not cancelled. It was not postponed. And we, we had the lesson with, uh, but it was not, uh, I mean, a lot of persons in that case, but but uh, it, it was on. So try tomorrow because tomorrow it will be on and it goes until uh, Friday. So it will be uh, at the same time as uh, advertised, exactly the same um, the same link. So maybe I should repost it. I should do that. Maybe it would be better. Uh, Walid, hello from uh, Montreal. You're the best. Merci beaucoup, monsieur. Um, well, I hope everything is going fine in uh, Montreal. Be careful with the, the virus too. So stay inside. Alors, what is the meaning of uh, I wonder. I don't really know how you write. Uh, so nam uh, How do you want to to do? Cela été or or I'm not sure because it's a, the way you write it. It's a, it's a, it's a bit uh, it's a bit puzzling. I I must say. Um, cet été, cela été, maybe it was, uh, depends on the context. I, I would really need a context to, 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 uh, to know exactly uh, uh, what do you mean, because cet été, this summer, <laughs> it would be uh, written differently. Um, I don't know. I really don't know. I mean, it's... Uh, are you sure about the way it's written and, and what is the context? So Nam, you, you need to give me a context, please. <laughs> so Mutia, bonsoir from Indonesia. Bonsoir, Mutia. I hope you're doing fine. Apparently, people are quiet now, so you don't want to write anymore. <laughs> I'm still I'm still wondering with this uh, this question from uh, Sonam. Yeah, give me a context. It would be it would be so great to have a context to have a situation when when you heard it because it's uh, right now it's puzzling the way it, uh, it is. Um, so Raymond, I learned a lot from your channel. Thanks from Montreal. Wow, I mean there are many persons from uh, Montreal. Huh? Uh, my pleasure, uh, Raymond. My pleasure. Uh, if, if it helped you, then it's it's great. Uh, bonsoir from uh, Turkey. Bonsoir, and I, I hope everything is going fine in uh, Turkey. Same thing here. Be careful with the the virus. Nicola, I'm studying translator English and Spanish. I'm from Chile. I want to learn French. The good thing about uh, you, uh, Nicola, I don't know if uh, Spanish is your as if you're Chile. Yeah. Uh, Spanish is your uh, mother tongue. It means that normally it will be uh, it will be it will be simple for you. You will have to be careful with uh, certain things because uh, uh, Spanish uh, speaking students that I've been having and I've been having quite a lot. Uh, of course, they will. You will understand. Uh, uh, I mean, the structure of the language. It won't be a problem. You will understand uh, the subjunctive, which will be a big, big thing for you. So basically, uh, this is a great thing. Uh, you just need to be careful about the pronunciation because uh, you might uh, struggle with little things, but uh, in most of the cases, it's it's uh, it is quite simple for uh, Spanish speaking persons. Uh, how much time, weeks, and months do you think should be taken for focus and focus uh, on phonetics in learning French? Beginner versus intermediate versus advanced. I have high school students in mind and private tutoring. Um, so Quincy, that uh, it, it is a good question, but from my experience, it's uh, it's always puzzling. It's always a, a surprise. 
because basically the phonetics in some cases when you are facing a, a, a class a classroom in some cases it can go so, so fast for certain students and 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 for others uh, it can be a uh, it can be more challenging, so it really depends, um, and it depends what what the, the the objective is for the the the, the class that you have. Uh, if the objective is to really uh, make sure that they will pronounce perfectly, and 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 it will be the thing that will be first rather than the the, the grammar, then in that case you should uh, definitely uh, work a lot of it, on it. Uh, background of the students, uh, native tongues. It's it's a uh, it's a key thing too. Because if if you are facing a, a classroom or students uh, coming from different areas of the world and with different mother tongues, then in that case it will be they will have different type of uh, challenges. So you will have to adapt. But uh, uh, phonetics is important to my my to my experience. I mean phonetics is the key. Most of the cases people want to learn French to be able to talk, so. Uh, Nicolas Mathias, I am 20 years old. Félicitations. <laughs> Alors, uh, good evening for, from South Africa. Well, good evening, uh, Pumero. And uh, I, I hope that uh, you're safe and uh, be careful with the, the virus. Ah, well, comment ça a été? Okay, thank you very much, uh, Walid. Um, no, yeah, of course, comment ça a été, in that case, it's, uh, how did it go? Uh, ça s'est bien passé. <laughs> Alors, uh, Lid, are there any common mistakes people make when learning French that they should try to avoid? What's your best advice for learning it? Thanks. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, there are some common mistakes, but, but the common mistakes in most of the cases, they're coming from uh, from your uh, your native tongue, um, so because in most of the cases you will see that uh, people who are coming from or have uh, uh, certain uh, uh, languages, they will tend to make uh, the same mistakes. In fact, so uh, yes, but it, it really depends on your uh, on your, uh, and it's okay to make mistakes. I mean, this is the point. You know, when when you start to learn a language and and if you want to 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 speak. I mean, it's totally okay to make mistakes. At least this is the way I see it. As long as you try, you try your best. And we're not stupid. I mean, you listen to people, they will react to it. You will you will learn by, by making mistakes in most of the cases. This is the way I, I learned uh, the, the, the languages that I'm, I'm using. Um, um, how do I improve my speaking uh, to a B1 level? It's a good question, Amanda. Um, so B1 level, it depends exactly what what uh, I mean. What you want to do with the B1? Uh, if you plan to 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 pass the DEL for or what do you really mean by uh, by B1 in that case? Um, the best way to to improve the the, the 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 biggest challenge in most of the cases when you learn on your own is to be able to 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 speak, is to be able to 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 pronounce uh, perfectly. So um, you can try to 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 listen to things. You can try to repeat uh, to things. Even in some cases, I I tend to to tell to my students that they should uh, probably record themselves and try to listen to themselves, but it's extremely difficult to, to, uh, to hear your, uh, your own mistakes. Um, at this level, B1, B1, B2, I mean, you really, I think you would need to interact with people, I mean, for real, and, and this is the best way to, to improve your, uh, your speaking skills. Be careful, you need to, to have like a pact with them, you need to, to decide that you will speak only French. So don't don't go, uh, you know, playing with the languages. I speak a bit of English, a bit of French. It, it doesn't work. You really need to switch. You need to jump. You need to try to 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 speak French all the time. I so learned French in two and three days, and I was very happy. I made a choice before I only knew we, oui, but now I can say I am better than before. <laughs> well, it's my pleasure, Revo. So of course, uh, when I made these uh, these videos with two days, five days, ten days, I've been trying to gather uh, all the grammar thing, and it's a lot. Uh, uh, and I know that in most of the cases, people need a lot of time to to digest and process. But still, these these are the things that you 
you you you should normally know when uh, when you want to master the language. Bonjour from uh, Morocco. Bonjour uh, Asare or Jonas. Uh, hello Tam. Uh, Dick Honest, COD and COE, what is the difference? Well, it's a big difference, and I've been making some videos on that, but let's say that the main difference is the preposition. But it's, 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 it's a whole lesson, you know. So I've been making videos. You can find them on the channel. Bonsoir, j'ai commencé à apprendre le français il y a quelques années. Maintenant, je suis professeur de français. Oh, mon Dieu, Ahmed, thank you very much. Um, I'm so happy if, you, if, you, if, I, if I, you know, gave you the possibility to... To, to, to help you uh, to, to fulfill your dream of, uh, of, of becoming French teacher. My pleasure, really my pleasure. And I hope you enjoy it. Uh, I'm not sure about the spelling, but I enjoy it. Uh, ça va, ça a été. Ah, ça a été. Yeah, how was it? Uh, yeah, so, so, so Sonam, you can answer with oui, ça va. Oui, ça va, it's, it's in the present and the, the question touches the past. So basically, maybe you should you should answer with oui, ça a été. Hein, ça a été. Ça s'est bien passé. It, it's, it's another option. Just rephrase, and this is the point, ça a été, it's, it's good. En ce qui concerne les examens comme TEF, est-ce que vous proposez des cours particuliers Préparation en ligne. Um, yeah, for the, I mean, TF, TCF, it, de, it really depends. Uh, Mohamed, I, I don't know what is your mother tongue and then if you are surrounded by, uh, by French speaking persons, because this is, the, this is the key. But I mean, these TF and TCF, they're a bit like special. So maybe it's always good to, to, to have somebody to, to, to guide you at least. And probably you will have some questions. So and, and, and really they don't look like it, but you need to master the grammar. I mean, you need to go through the grammar uh, at one point. Amanda, l'année dernière, j'ai commencé à étudier la grammaire quelques phrases en français. Maintenant, j'aime regarder des documentaires sur l'histoire en français. Oh, mon Dieu, Amanda. I'm so happy that, that I can help you. 70% yeah this is the thing you know with with uh, talking talking is is a, is a big step so and the main thing amanda uh, if if you can write uh, um, it's always a good step to 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 focus first on the writing then it's always simple to to start to talk uh, the opposite doesn't work i mean in most of the cases from what i saw People who can talk fluently because they've been learning like that, you know, with people, when it comes to writing, it's like, it's extremely challenging. So uh, this is the way, but, uh, but uh, Amanda, félicitations. Uh, are the days of the week were nationally profound nouns in French? If yes, then... Ah, for the days of the no, we we we're not like um, like in English. In, in English, they, they 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 want to capitalize uh, a lot of of things, and uh, in French, we don't. And the, the good example is uh, in most of the cases the when when you use French. So français, français, you can use it with a little letter when it's considered to be a, an adjective, and and. Um, and it will be exact. I mean, it, it you put a capital when it's a, when it's a noun. So, so uh, we're not uh, th this this conception of uh, capitalizing and uh, having small letters. It's not universal, unfortunately. Uh, I am from Somalia. I live in France. J'ai appris la langue française depuis un an. Yeah, it is. It is. Uh, so, Dick, uh, honest. Take take the time. Take the time. Don't be frustrating. The learning curve of French is not the same as uh, the English learning curve. Uh, French is extremely difficult at the beginning, but little by little, it will become more and more simple. So, but it's extremely difficult at the beginning. So, don't give up. This is the point. Don't give up. Try always, 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 you know, insist on talking, listen, practice. You are in France, so basically you can practice a lot. Listen, read, look at the in the streets, you get all the advertisements, everything. I mean it's it's uh, it's it's really it's really good. Uh, so I am what I create. It's hard uh, to listen to your own voice when learning a new language uh, a new language. It's true. Uh, it's true. It's extremely, extremely hard to correct yourself, and, and this is the frustration of of uh, students. This is when you need somehow to have somebody to guide you uh, through the the the, um, 
through the, the phonetics and the pronunciation. Um, I mean, so far, <laughs> so far, it's the only it's the only thing that you need uh, you need to have a teacher for that, and it's true. Uh, what is the difference between se and il? Uh, I've been making a video regarding this topic because it's a, it's a, it's a recurrent question. I mean, people ask that uh, all the time. Uh, so you can go, uh, you can go to the, the channel, you will see a, a, a video covering that. Uh, Louis Evans, Vincent, is it true that most French people can speak English? Um, I wouldn't say that. Uh, from what I saw, it's, uh, well, generation of my parents, it was, it was another story. My generation, they were shy. Uh, in most of the cases, uh, they, 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 they tried to avoid to speak French. And then the other generation, so I'm talking about the millennials now, I mean, they are extremely happy to, to, to speak English. We've got an accent. We, 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 we struggle with the words. But it's okay. It's just like, you know, when, when you start to speak French, I guess, if you try to speak French, you will struggle, but it's okay. So yes, they, they can speak English, uh, they can understand English, but uh, they might not speak English uh, um, like easily. Je pensais que tu expliques en français, mais... <laughs> well, um, so Boris, yeah. I've been, I've been starting to, to, to do like that. Uh, it's the, the, the way I teach uh, for, for this uh, I mean, channel and in other contexts, but it depends. Um, but this is, the, this is the, the, the way I decided to do. I decided to explain things uh, uh, in English. Uh, there are other teachers. I mean, on, on YouTube, you can find other people uh, uh, teaching in, in, in French and, and, and it's okay. But in, in, in certain cases, and I think for tricky topics, uh, uh, especially at the beginning, I think it's, it's, it's better in some cases to, 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 to explain in English. Uh, during my classes, during my courses, in most of the cases, what I'm doing is that first I explain English and little by little we, we decrease and, and in the end, uh, I only speak English, uh, French, sorry. This is the, 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 the best option, I think. I mean, it's working. So uh, people want, you know, things that are working. Vincent, do you have any experience with the Sorbonne Diplôme? What is your experience about them? You're talking about what the Sor Sorbonne Diplôme is? You're talking about the diplomas uh, regarding the, the, the language or or... Because I don't know. I mean, Sorbonne is a is a good uh, good university. I, I was not there. I was in the Paris 8. But uh, could you could you tell me exactly what you mean with this Sorbonne question? Because I'm not really sure I understand. Merci beaucoup pour toutes les aides. Prenez soin particulièrement. Yeah, thank you very much, uh, Raymond. And uh, everyone, stay inside. Louis Evans, Vincent, do you drink alcohol? Uh, yeah, I mean, it's possible. <laughs> um, well, I'm French, you know, so I mean, for us, it's not like, a, it's not a big taboo. I mean, it's just like, a, but it's with moderation, like for the rest, you need to, you need to be moderate. Um, but in my family, it was not, it was not a big thing. I mean, my parents were not drinking wine when we were having lunch or, or dinner. So it was not never a big, big thing in the, in the family. Uh, hi, Dana. Bonjour, bonsoir. Alors, uh, Ali, bonjour Vincent. Combien de langues pouvez-vous parler? Ali, je vais vous répondre en français. Je peux parler trois langues. Um, well, in fact, yeah, we're speaking three languages at home. Uh, so this is, this is the way it goes. Uh, life <laughs> and the changes of life have been making it so. It's been two years that I'm in France, but I still uh, don't speak good French. So now, yeah, try, try. It takes, it takes, it takes some, it takes some time. But but uh, if you really try hard, I mean, you will, uh, you will make it. It's not, uh, it's not a problem. On peut apprendre le français et l'anglais en même temps. Not sure if it's a good. Uh, it, it's difficult. I mean, people are different, so I don't really know what what uh, what to say with the the fact that you're learning two languages uh, at the same time. The tricky thing with French and English, or 
<laughs> it's just that the, the 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 languages are quite close, so so it could be uh, it could be tricky, I think. Uh, but try and 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 probably you will make it. Uh, Carlton in Brazil, yes, well, it's sad, but uh, it's in many countries now. So, what French people think when someone speaks English in France? They don't like it or they don't care. Depends where you go, uh, Sonam. Uh, it really depends where you go. If uh, if you're in Paris, for instance, I mean, in most of the cases, uh, I, right now it might change, but I mean, they, they tend to change quite fast to to, to English. Uh, if it's for services and things like that. Uh, but we tend to think that if you want to really discuss with people, then in that case, uh, of course, they will they will switch to to, to French. Um, you can have some good experience or bad experience with uh, with with languages. Uh, it's extremely difficult to to to, to say. Uh, but of course, I mean French people. If you compare to other uh, countries, maybe where the language is, I'm talking about the Nordic countries, for instance, they're not so so protective of their languages. So, and they're used to 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 speak English. Uh, it's not that much the case in in France or in other countries. I'm thinking about Spain, maybe or Italy. So, uh, it's not easy, but my teacher uh, think like a child. He speaks about both English and French because I learned. Uh, we so the, the the question of translation and and um, yeah. It, I, I think it's a it's a common it's a common reflex. I mean, to to first start to 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 translate, and of course, it's, uh, it's somehow it's reassuring. People feel uh, more at ease, I guess, when they start to 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 translate from their native tongue to 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 another tongue. But it doesn't work. I mean, we know that uh, it doesn't work. But it takes it takes some some times to 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 uh, to construct and to visualize the the, the language. So um, yes, going going think like a child is a good thing, but uh, but in a way it's also think like a, a, a teenager or maybe somebody who could construct uh, sentences a bit more complex because uh, after a while you this is what you want to do you want to start to be able to construct your own sentences and they can be complex too. Uh, salut Gilles, bonjour Cheryl, comment allez-vous? Salut Vincent, merci beaucoup. Well, my pleasure. Uh, so, Hamza, I'm following your 50-day uh, courses. It's very helpful. Please tell me some technique to improve uh, to improve my French listening. Uh, this is a this is a tricky thing too for the the, the listening uh, skills. I, I I would tend to to tell you to try to listen to. Um, well, it depends. Um, there are different approaches that that you can have. Uh, if you're at the real beginning, you really need to go for the I mean things that I've been doing, for instance, with words. After that, you start to go with the the, the sentences, some phrases, and after that, you start to 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 listen, or you should try to listen to what we call document authentique, so the the real stuff. And uh, real stuff, you need to be careful because if you go to uh, on YouTube with the YouTubers and I mean young people, they tend to speak so fast and they 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 drop some some words, which is totally okay. I mean you can go back to these these uh, these documents after, but first you should start with the uh, I mean real French like like with the real construction, uh, so you can I mean watch I don't know. Uh, TV or or in most of the cases I tend to 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 inform or to say people maybe they should watch the the, the news even if it's going fast they know uh, in most of the cases the words they know the topics because I mean the news are the same everywhere uh, so it is somehow a good uh, good introduction uh, you can watch TV you can watch the ads you can watch all these things that can be as long as you try to listen to different type of things, uh, it will be it will be good. Ça fait longtemps que je vous ai pas vu. Yeah, well, I was working on different projects, uh, different projects. So, uh, I mean, YouTube, it was. Um, but I'm coming back. Can I join the free Zoom uh, teaching tomorrow? Yes, you can. Of course, Amanda. I mean, it would be a pleasure to to uh, uh, 
to have you. So uh, I guess you've got the, the, the address and the, and the code and everything. It, it, it doesn't change, it's the same. So the, the, the course is supposed to, to repeat itself uh, during, um, during all the week at the same time. Uh, Louis Evans, have you heard Jodie Foster speaking French? She's an American actor, but she was, yeah, 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 yeah. Jodie Foster, she 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 really speaks well uh, French. I, I remember, but it was a long, long time ago when I was young, and she was young, so I was uh, was hearing, uh, listening to her, and I was uh, was really really surprised. And uh, I mean, I like the actress too. She's uh, she's a nice person. Uh, so now, I'm, oh well. I'm happy that that uh, that. So you're coming from Tibet, so it, it's not a cultural shock for you in uh, in France. Uh, alors, Geo Geo, my husband is French. Unfortunately, we communicate in English. Can you give me an advice? Yeah. So <laughs> this this uh, this situation is 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 totally normal. So basically, you you think that somehow you're married to a French person, and then it will be so simple to 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 learn the the language. And in some cases, in many situations, and I've been knowing a lot of uh, situations like that, it's uh, it is challenging. It is challenging, especially when when you started to establish a communication language. In your case, apparently, it's English. So of course, it's it's always challenging to start to switch from one language to to another. Um, it is possible. I've been having some, I don't know, uh, friends and, and and people I know. They decided to have one day per week when uh, they were um, uh, talking uh, in 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 French, for instance. Um, in other cases, it depends when you when you start to have uh, children and. I, <laughs> I don't know what is your situation. The, the good thing when you've got some kids, I mean, the, the thing is that the, the, the language, if everybody is using uh, his own language, in that case, French start to arrive naturally in uh, in the family. And so it's a good thing for you because probably your husband will talk uh, French with the, the, the children. You will hear that. It's a good way to, to, to practice. And, uh, and when you eat, for instance, I mean, this is how it happens in, in, in my family. Everyone is using uh, his language. So you get all these language that are on the table, but still no problem. So we learn like that. Uh, so don't worry, you will you will make it. <laughs> but it might be a bit more challenging that if you had a, a, a regular French teacher. Paul, salut Vincent, big fan of your courses. Thank you very much, Paul. Uh, bonjour Lydia, hello from Toronto. I hope everything is going fine for you. Be careful with the virus because it's not a nice time. Uh, I am moving to Quebec and your course. Uh, yeah, yeah. Um, well, I'm, I'm, I, I, I was planning at one point too, but it's, it's a lot of work to prepare some special, uh, special videos and special course for uh, TEF and TCF. But um, but I guess that uh, Paul, you should really concentrate on the. I don't know if the grammar, because as I said previously, uh, these exam they 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 look like uh, not really focusing on the grammar, but but uh, still at one point you really need, especially when you go higher and higher, you will have to really master the the, the grammar, and and even if you want to interact with people, I mean you you need to master the the, the grammar. So don't don't be afraid to look at the videos. Work on the grammar because it's it's the best way. Uh, yeah, Sylvia, I, I will um, I will put that in the because I cannot copy paste on this on this machine, but um, I will um, I will put that in the in in the YouTube um, thing where where you can put some pictures and uh, and text. So so have a look. It it will be there for uh, for tomorrow. But it's tomorrow at uh, at uh, four Paris time. So I am able to dedicate six hours a day, uh, no distraction. Difficult to say, Paul. Um, I, I've been I've been seeing so many things uh, uh, happening with the languages. In some cases, people can go so so fast, and in other cases, it takes uh, it takes a bit a bit longer. Um, you need to be to be to be really uh, focused on your uh, on your goal. 
this is this is the point uh, you need to try to find and this is the main thing you know in most of the cases we know how we learn uh, so you need to find uh, the best way for you to learn uh, uh, and, and and the most efficient way to, to learn i remember a student that uh, he had to, to visualize the thing so he was putting some uh, some post-it <laughs> everywhere in his house just to 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 memorize the the the, the name of the the, the things and uh, and it worked, but but uh, but he knew that it was it was good for him. So try to see uh, and to to understand what is good for you, and I guess you you will find the answer. Uh, Grace, uh, the 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 time for the Zoom session it will be at four uh, Paris time, so after uh, four in the afternoon, so four p.m. Paris time. So I guess it will. Uh, uh, it will help you to find according to your your time time zone. Bonjour d'Alaska. Uh, I am beginning adult student French speaking. Why are you French to hear typical French conversation? Yeah, um, I'm I'm still working on the, the discussions and conversations, but it's a, it's a it's a long process. So, uh, but it's good. I mean, discussions and and conversations. I mean, they're they're really they're really nice. Yes. Uh, with the subtitles, obviously, it's uh, it's the best option uh, in French. <laughs> Subtitled in French. Uh, so, what other languages do I speak? I speak English because I'm I'm, I'm here. Uh, the other one, it's this obscure language. Uh, it's uh, Finnish, uh, the language of Finland. I speak Finnish too. One thing that should help is motivation. If you're motivated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, uh, I am what I create. One thousand nine ninety nine. It's it's true. It's true. When 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 you start to to uh, to learn something, uh, it must be fun. Uh, it must be fun. Even in in I mean in the classroom when I'm teaching uh, regularly, uh, it must be fun. Otherwise, it's not. It's not fun to teach. It's not fun to 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 learn. So uh, you, you need to be motivated, but it's it's just like a language. It's learning a new skills. It's it's always nice, I guess. Uh, pronunciation is a big problem for me. Yeah, this pronunciation thing is uh, you, you get two aspects of it. The first aspect is the, the the well the reaction of the others if if you mispronounce. But the first thing, and probably uh, people are extremely uh, tough uh, on themselves because they tend to think that uh, they don't pronounce uh, well. And um, in some cases it's true, but in most of the cases it's not that that true. Uh, you will always uh, have an accent and, and, and it's okay. It's okay to have an accent. I think it's nice because it indicates where I mean you're coming from, and and you're not supposed to speak like uh, I mean, like a French. Even French people, I mean, they they pronounce differently according to the the region where they're they're coming from. So uh, pronunciation is important. So you need to work on it, and it's true. Uh, it is it is extremely true because I mean the writing. You get all the tools now that that can correct that uh, when you speak. I mean there is no tool that will uh, that will correct your pronunciation. So you must be uh, uh, careful. But also you need to realize that uh, you've got ears. You get you get a brain, and so basically this is the way it will go. Once you start to interact with people, you will learn by listening to them, by correcting the the the, the things that you've been uh, mispronouncing. So it will be okay. Uh, thank you, merci beaucoup, uh, but you're welcome, Geo, Geo. Don't worry, you will make it. <laughs> it worked for me. Um, okay, so you cannot... Uh, so they were in the wrong class. Yeah, I, I don't know what happened with this, this Zoom thing. So, uh, because I had some students, not a lot. I mean, it was uh, it was uh, which was I mean quite quite good because everyone had the the, the chance to to pronounce. Uh, but um, but uh, but but yeah, today it, it, it it's uh, it's another day. So, Ali, what university did you go? Uh, to and what did you study? Yeah, so I went to uh, the University of uh, Paris 8, so Paris. Eight and it's uh, ex Vincennes. Um, I was studying uh, communication and, and sciences of the, the language. So basically, uh, 
I was not that far from uh, what I'm doing because I am using communications tool and I'm, I'm teaching uh, in English. If a C is followed by uh, I well, of course. I mean, Pumero is asking if there are some exceptions in French regarding. Uh, um, that uh, the pronunciation, yeah, I've been making uh, been making some uh, some videos covering the phonetics. There is a big video that I I, I really took. Uh, it took me a long time to to do it, and uh, it's covering the letters and especially st I mean C C is uh, is a tricky one because uh, C uh, can be uh, it depends with the the, the, the vowels that uh, that uh, will come after. In some cases, you will pronounce like k k k, and in other cases, you will pronounce like s s s. And 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 you will see that we've got also what we call this c d that will transform the k k k into s s s. So, uh, but to make it simple, I mean, go yeah. There there are some. Uh, I've been making several videos covering uh, covering this topic, so uh, you can uh, you can find them on uh, the channel. Well. I think I will let you go because uh, it will be time for me to uh, to eat a bit. It was really nice to 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 chat with you. Remember, the Zoom is uh, is tomorrow, so basically you can uh, you can join. Uh, let's see uh, how it will go, and um, so the, the I will put again, I guess, the the, the address and uh, the code and everything. Um, and uh, thank you very much. So uh, enjoy your evening, morning, or afternoon. Au revoir.